Hello ladies and gentlemen and as always thank you for watching. Uh, this morning we've been called by Missouri State Highway Patrol uh, for a passenger vehicle in a water filled ditch so I'm going to have to go fishing this morning. I've got my uh, waders on. Uh, they did not say to expedite so I'm not going to have my red and blue lights and siren going. But as always, I'm going to respond as quickly as possible. Uh, we'll get there and see what's going on and uh, go from there. We are almost there. I see the uh, uh, police officer's lights. So we'll find out what's going on. All I was told was that there was a, I believe a G6 and a water-filled ditch. Morning, sir. Now, uh, I can't see into the back seat. Yes, sir. Probably should have gotten in the water and checked, but from what I could tell, there's no one in it, and I saw some footprints. So, uh, well, I've got waders on. Okay. I'll I'll be glad to go check. Okay, if you don't mind. Yes, sir. Uh, what, what's your name? Ron Pratt. P R A T T. Okay. You related to Bruce Pratt? Uh, no. You mean with Scott County? Well, yeah, him or there's a trooper. Okay. No, sir, not to my knowledge, but we could be. Yes, sir. Yeah, the water's... I'm hoping there's nobody in there. Water's flowing through here. Uh, not that I see. Water flowing, but that's it. Let me check the other side. Okay. The keys are in there still. Yes, sir. Keys are in it and what was it? Uh, turn signals on or something. Your lights were on. Lights. Surprised they're still working with all this water in here. Do you need any identifiers out of here or do you want to wait till I get it up? We'll just do that first. Okay, all right. Yes, sir. Uh, I want to finish the post sheet and then I'll be back with you. Yes, sir.
Time to go fishing. cable on this thing. This short cable's killing me. These trucks come standard with 50 foot cable. They only got three wraps on the drum. And that car is not that far off the road. We're gonna have to fix that today. 50 foot is not enough cable. Okay. For around here anyway. Maybe okay in some areas, but not here. Water's chilly. All right, run the strap under the seat or in front of the seat. There you go. Now it's time to get down and dirty. Got to get under the car with the strap, or at least under the wheels. Start it off. Go on above the car on this one. Or at least low. Alright. Grab the other strap. The end of the strap, that is. All right. 
Sarnia. Shirt's already soaking wet, so it doesn't matter. Grab my remote and head back down to the car. float on me. sit here for a minute and drain some of the water out of it. It'll sit here. All right, that's enough to get the straps loose.
Yep, we're recording. Good deal. Just want to make sure. way to start today. Is on preschool. All right. Lock it back in. Again, really uh, give us least amount of resistance. Oop. I don't like that. Let my bed down some more. Cable running over the sharp edge, not good. Just throw the strap up in there for now. You want to get the identifiers now, or do you want me to get it up on the level? Unless you want to go ahead and get it. No, sir. I just locked it down so it wouldn't uh, move on you, or it had less chance of moving yeah, on you. Yeah, yeah.
Yes, sir. Well, I didn't bring a pen with me. I left my phone and everything in the truck because I knew I was going to be in the water. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. You know, I don't really know if I worked this as a crash or just a, I mean, single I, vehicle. I couldn't tell you. I don't know. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I down south sometimes we just work these as a strained and abandoned vehicle. But well, it was an accident. Damage. Well, it, it went in the water too, so that's yeah. water. You know, in especially if they've got like liability only. Right. You know, you just it's on them anyway. So. Yeah. But yep. uh, I'm gonna see if she's got insurance. Um okay. quick, that's the main thing I need to grab, but I will ask that when they come to get this vehicle, yes sir, don't give it to them until they talk to me first. Yes, sir. I, I put releasable on here just that way so you can sign and everything. Yes, but, sir. Uh, Understood. But I need to talk to them wonder why the heck she left just the left car it. Right. The ditch crash in the ditch. You know, right. So. They may have May have had to seek medical treatment or something. Who knows? Yeah, that's true too. I might have to go. That was the water helps cushion the ride, but yeah. still looks like it was a pretty nasty ride. Yeah. It looks like they went all the way up on the other side, and then the the water. Of course, we had some heavy rain. That water could have carried the car back down into the yeah. drainage ditch. Yeah. You can see where she went up and he slipped back down. Yep. Yes, sir, you sure can. Mainly hit. Oh, yeah, it's... We get a lot of these G6s. Yeah. I mean, a lot of them. I don't know why. I've, I've been stopping quite a few lately. Have you? <laughs> yeah. A lot of stuff. Imagine everything's pretty well soaked, isn't it? What was she doing on this I road? No, because she's coming this direction. Huh. I couldn't find any insurance. So. Unfortunately, that's not surprising. Which leaves you guys stuck with the that's not surprising Typically either. They won't come get it. Yeah. So. 
All right, well, I'm gonna go try to track her down. Uh, if okay. If you get contacted by them or anybody with the vehicle, let me know, because I would like to talk to them before they get it. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. By all means. Appreciate it. Yes, sir. Thank you. Yes, sir. No problem. I think the car is toast. Stay there, baby.
starts leaking. Thank you for stick. Do what, sir? Yeah, yeah, no problem. It makes me more angry. People not slowing down, not moving over. I know, I know. I pulled out a little further. <laughs> there it is. I saw that, and I appreciate it very it much. I appreciate you sticking with no me no and problem. helping cover me. Yeah, no problem. no problem. It's out of there. You or I, neither one will probably ever see her, but or her, him, whatever. I'll track her down. That's something else that frustrates me. You crash your car, you leave. I mean, that's not a bad car. Why would you leave a car like that? I mean, it's not as good anymore, but still, you know, it's. We get so many of them that people just abandon. We had one uh, a trooper called us back on. He had worked a wreck. It was uh, uh, shoot, McDaniel. Yeah. Sorry, yeah, yeah. uh, our Corporal McDaniel. Yeah. And uh, down Benton Hill, a Volvo, little Volvo car had spun out and went into the median. And he tagged it. A couple of days later, he gets a call for a wreck at the same location with a vehicle matching a similar description. People are down there stripping it out, pulling license plates and everything off of it. Yeah. It's still sitting at our shop. <laughs> no, you really don't. You really don't. Let's get off this road. All right. Thank you very much. Appreciate it, sir. a good way to start the day. Cool refreshing drip dip in uh, fresh running water. All right, well, hopefully nobody was injured. As always, thank you for watching. God bless.